what is up you guys it's your girl passion welcome back to my channel hey y'all so i'm currently um applying for some work at home jobs i just got done with my well i wasn't wearing this y'all got my pajamas on but i just got done with my um parenting class and i'm looking at some companies which i i googled and it's harder to find them on google because it's on indeed and you gotta apply through third parties and stuff like that and i really after my information has been stolen i really don't trust um doing that applying you know through websites i never even heard of but i went on youtube and i'm looking into some companies that i'm reading in the comments and other people who work at home um some of the companies i don't have any experience uh, working from home or anything like that i did receive a job offer um for aetna cvs but um I could not fulfill it because those hours wouldn't work for me with the stuff that I have going on. So, um, yeah, so that's what I'm trying to find, something that's, like, flexible to your schedule. You can work another job, stuff like that. So, um, that's what I got going on right now. And I've been at home. Uh, I told y'all in another vlog that my son has been sick. I'm not coming Anyways, I'll be back with y'all in a She's super freaky. <laughs> hey y'all, good morning. Um, I'm about to, I'm not going to say attempt because I'm going to put my all into it. <laughs> um, I'm going to do my very, very best, but I'm going to um, be jump roping this morning and depending on how I feel after, like my goal is to do 100 um i don't have my knee brace which next time i probably will wear it depending on how i feel today but after i jump rope um depending on how i feel then i'm gonna go work out and do some weights and stuff but that's gonna be my cardio for today um is jump roping so i'm gonna take y'all along with me um this will be day one my first time doing it so y'all about to see the kinks and all that I'm, I'm pretty sure i'm gonna be tired already but like i said i'm gonna do my very best i'm gonna do it period <laughs> Y'all, I'm out of breath. I did 60. My throat is burning. Jump open. Ain't no joke. Woo. <clears throat> 60 to some people probably is nothing, but you try it. <laughs> Woo. My throat is burning. I think that's good, though, because that means it's opening up my chest. So I got 40 more to do. I'm actually surprised and proud of myself. Ooh, I'll be back with y'all when I finish. I'm about to go work out now, y'all, because I don't feel like that jump rope was enough, but I know I can't do no more right now. So I'm about to do some weights and stuff. Um, I really don't feel like working out today, but I'm about to push myself and do it. I just got done working out, y'all. Now I'm taking a, a rest. All right, y'all. So I was going to do legs, but um, it was so many people. Today was like really crowded. Whew. And I know it's later. Usually I ought to be out of here by now. It's 9.15. But, um, y'all, girl, for me not to be feeling like not doing it, because I was kind of like, nah, I don't really like being, like, working out in a public on my cycle. Like, 
you know, you already don't feel comfortable. And then, you know what I'm saying? Like, so I was like, no, I'm not going to do it. And I was like, maybe I should just jump rope and be outside. But y'all see how that happened. I did my goal. I told y'all that I was going to attempt to do it. Um, and I did it. Well, I didn't say attempt. I said, I'm going to do it. And I did it. I, when, once I got to 60, I was like, should I stop? Because, whoo, like my chest has been, and it's been like 30 minutes since I did it. My chest is like still on fire. I feel like it's opened up, but my heart was beating so fast. Like, but, um, so anywho, I got that done. I did work out. So I did do something. So I don't feel that bad but i do feel bad because i feel like i didn't do enough even though i did work out excuse me i mainly did arms and i did do some abs one ab machine i was gonna get on i was like whatever i might as well just get on it so i got on that um but i want to do legs like i don't feel like i'm doing enough today i didn't feel like i was doing enough but at least that i did something instead of i could be at home in my bed right now you know and oh my stomach girl y'all but um i'm gonna take my apple cider vinegar when i get home I need to take my B6 vitamin because y'all know I'm still numb. And um, I'm probably going to make me a smoothie. I don't feel like no oatmeal on nothing today. I'm not, I don't know yet. I'm not sure exactly what I'm going to eat. But um, I just met someone else. When I was sitting in the hallway, um, he had told me, he looked at my jump rope and he was like, I was just doing that. And oh my goodness. And I was like, I did 100. And he's in more shape than I am. He was like, 100? Like, Ooh, wait, that's hard. I've been watching YouTube videos and that's where I got the idea from to do um, jump roping. I had this jump rope for like over a year now and I've never been outside because I'm like, if I do it at, at my um, apartments, people are gonna be looking at me, you know, blah, blah, blah. So long story short, he just showed me a room. I mean, different rooms in there um, that you can go in. I thought those were only designated for um, classes and stuff, but um, I'm not sure if it's because of COVID and they're not doing classes right now or their classes on certain days. At least they're not um, doing classes while I'm here. But they have exercise equipment. They have like those little ballet um, things, like the winning things where, you know, you practice ballet. They have yoga stuff, um, weight balls and all that outside of the gym area that has all the gym equipment in there. And I didn't even know that you can go in there. So... I was like, that's cool. And then they got mirrors that you can like look at yourself while you're working out. So I could bring my yoga mat and he said, um, cause he does the gym part, but he said he goes off into the room. So, you know, if you doing crunches and you doing your workout and you like, oh, you know, making noise and stuff like that. Certain things he said he don't feel comfortable doing in there. And that's the same way I'm feeling too. Certain things I don't want to do like squats and all that kind of stuff. So, um, that was pretty cool that he showed me that and i'm like oh i can get my own peace of mind if i <laughs> mess up or trip or fall or if i i don't know pass gas or something at least i'll be in here by myself i'm done y'all but um oh i'm so happy and thankful that i got up and did it today because the way that i'm feeling the way my stomach is set up whoo but um Dang, it was something else. Let me think about it, y'all. Oh, y'all, that's another thing that I was going to tell y'all about. Why it look like somebody in this car in front of me? Am I tripping? I don't know. But anyway, um, y'all, I feel like I was going to throw up. Like, when I went, when I first went in to work out, I sat down in the hallway. And I was like, dang, my mouth getting watery after I got done jump roping. And you know how some guys, they be playing basketball, and you'll see them on the side throwing up? you know from i guess you're not used to doing all that workout or something like that but from the jump i was like please don't let me throw up and i'm like am i gonna be able to do a workout so i got myself together took off my jacket and all that then i went in and i started doing the um the weights and when i was sitting there i'm like dang i still feel like i'm gonna throw up and i feel like i had to cough but i didn't want to be embarrassed and cough in front of everybody you know because everybody be looking like like coughing or sneezing people be looking at you so um, I just started talking to myself in my head and I'm like, please don't have me throw up. And I'm like, maybe I'll just go take a break, go to the bathroom, throw up and come back. But, um, is that a good sign? I don't know. I think maybe that's a good sign that you, I don't know what that means, y'all, but I didn't throw up. I definitely felt like I had to, like for real, for real. I definitely felt like I had to. My chest was burning so bad. Since I've been working out, my chest ain't never burnt that bad. So I've always heard it's like opening up your airways and your chest. So that's a good thing. But the way it feels, I feel like something was wrong with me. After I got done jump roping, 
I feel like something was wrong. Like my heart was like do 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 beating super fast and my chest was burning. Like no matter how much water I was drinking. But yeah, so anywho, so y'all coming with me on my journey. Like I told y'all, it's gonna be more stuff that I'm gonna talk to y'all about. Um, I thank God that I got up today. Let me be y'all motivation, whoever it is. By the time y'all see this video, if y'all struggling just like me, um, y'all be DMing me on Instagram and stuff on the days I don't feel like doing nothing or not just working out or whatever. And I see certain things and I be like, okay, that motivated me to get up. So I hope this motivates y'all whenever y'all see this to do whatever you need to do. If it's not just um, working out something you've been procrastinating to do or you really don't feel like doing, but you know you need to. So um, I hope this inspires some of you. And it's still going to be some days where I'm probably not going to push through, you know, but I'm going to try my best. I really am because I'm serious. Like, I really am. So anyway, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Hit that notification bell so you can be notified of all of your girls' uploads. Hey, girl, hey, and I will see y'all in the next